I knew your mom was strict, but I never thought she'd go this far. I've never seen her get so angry. It kind of freaked me out. But then, this whole situation is freaking me out. What do you think I should do? Maybe she's bluffing. I can't believe she would send you away from all your friends and family just because she doesn't like some guy you're dating. I don't think she's bluffing. I think she'd really do it. She hates Kyle. Hates him with a capital H. So talk to your dad. He would never let her send you away. Are you kidding? Anything mom tells me to do. Besides, he can't really believe oh, that his little girl there. is dating boys. He it's still gone. thinks I'm 10 years old. I know what you mean. My dad still treats me like a little girl, too. He's in total denial. But I haven't really brought any guys home, so he hasn't had to deal with it, you know? Oh Sam, why do you think your mom hates Kyle so much? He's one of the coolest guys I know. I died to go out with him. He treats you okay, doesn't he? You know why. Seriously, I don't. I was thinking maybe he was rude to her, but that doesn't sound like him. He's always so sweet. But then I was thinking maybe she caught you guys doing something you shouldn't have been doing. Was that it? It's not any of those things. It's because of his past. What past? He spent a couple of years in juvie. Are you kidding me? Don't look so shocked. He's not some murderer or anything. He used to hang out with some lowlifes, and he got caught with a bunch of drugs. Don't look at me like that. You look like my mother. Why does everyone have to judge him? He made a mistake, he paid his debt to society, and he's a great guy. I'm sick of having to defend him when he didn't even do anything that bad. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm not being judgmental. I'm just shocked, that's all. I had no idea he was into all that. Makes me even more mysterious. But now I understand why your mom is flipping out. But you know, she's such a hypocrite. Because when she first met him, she liked him a lot. She told me she thought we were a good match and she thought he was really charming. She was actually happy for me, but now, since she found out, she acts like I'm dating some serial killer or something. She goes to me the other day, she goes, If that boy steps one foot in this house again, I'm sending you off to another state. That's harsh. It's so not fair that she isn't giving him a chance. He's such a great guy. Tell me about it. So, did he take the drugs or just sell them? Both, I think. But just for a little while. And he got busted in his old school. He got caught selling dope in the bathroom, and I think he was getting high with the kid he sold it to. So they sent it, him to Juvie for like two years and put him in a rehab program and everything, and now he's totally clean. Got great grades last year, totally turned his life around. All the teachers love him, all the kids like him, everyone likes him, except my mother. She's afraid he's going to turn you to drugs. If I wanted to do drugs, I wouldn't need Kyle to help me. I know that, but she doesn't. She's scared, Sam. Can't you see that? Don't take my mother's side, please. I'm not. I just think you should lay low with Kyle for a while. Let your mom cool off. And maybe you could get your mom to talk to his mom, so then she'll know how hard he's been working to straighten his life out. That would be a good idea, except that his mom doesn't exactly like me either. She thinks he should focus on school and not be dating at all. We're totally screwed. But it's kind of romantic in a way. You guys are like, ooh, Romeo and Juliet. Yeah, look how things turn out for them. <laughs> That's not funny. <laughs> look, I like Kyle and everything. I like him a lot. But I'm not the type who would do something as stupid as kill myself with the guy. Or even run away with him. That's so lame. It's something that would happen in a TV movie. So, what are you going to do? What can I do? Nothing. I don't really have any choice, do I? Maybe I'm going to see him at school and that's going to have to be enough for a while. Maybe one of these days my mom will come to her senses. But until then, there's no way I'm going to risk getting sent to some dorky out-of-state boarding school. That's just not going to happen. So, no more hanging out with Kyle after school? No more going to the movies? No more nothing? Looks that way. So what if he gets tired of waiting for you and starts going out with somebody else? Like who? I don't know, but 
there are a lot of girls who like him. If they find out he's available, they're going to pounce. Hey, I know. I'll go out with him, and that way I'll be able to keep an eye on him until your mom agrees to let you date him again. I don't know. Do you really think other girls are going to pounce? Yes. Yes, I do. I could be your safety net. But won't your mom freak out when she finds out about his drug history? Are you kidding? I think my mom will be thrilled now that I'm finally going out with a guy. And if she does find out, I really don't think she'll care. She's not nearly as strict as your mom. Well, I guess it could be a good idea. This way I won't have to totally give him up. I'll still be connected to him in some way. I'll be connected to him through you. Yeah, I'll be your connection. I'll be sure to keep him distracted and away from all the other girls. Okay, well, I guess I should tell him about this plan. Let him know that my mom's a freak and I can't be with him anymore. No, no, you can't tell him. You can't risk getting caught. I'll tell him. I'll explain everything. Just leave this all to me. I'll take care of it. And I'm sure, I'm sure he'll understand, too. I'm sure he doesn't want you going off to Switzerland or wherever it is your mom would send you. And at least he'll still get to see you every day at school. Yeah, well, I guess this is the best solution. Tell him that I can't call him because my mother is monitoring my phone calls. And tell him that I miss him. And tell him that... Yeah, yeah, I'll tell him everything. I'm going to go find him now so you don't have to worry about it. You can definitely count on me. See you later. See you soon.